and the masters of the universe. I am Adam, Prince of Eternia and defender of the secrets of Castle Grayskull. This is Cringer, my fearless friend. Fabulous secret powers were revealed to me the day I held aloft my magic sword and said, By the power of Grayskull! became the mighty battle cat and I became He-Man, the most powerful man in the universe. Only three others share this secret. Our friends, the Sorceress, Man-at-Arms, and Orko. Together we defend Castle Grayskull from the evil forces of Skeletor. He-Man. No, Orko, that won't be necessary. It's just a loose belt. And we're almost finished. Okay. But what's it gonna be a magician if no one ever wants you to use your magic? <laughs> a magician. <laughs> Did I hear someone say he's a magician? Yeah, me. But who are you? Permit me to introduce myself. I am Kathos, and I, too, was a magician until Evil Lynn's wicked spell changed me into this. But if you're a magician, maybe you can help change me back. Orko, what's going on? Well, I finally found someone who really appreciates good magic. <laughs> At last, <laughs> I'm free. Tila, look, isn't that the evil wizard Kathos with Orko? You're right, let's go. <laughs> Thank you, Orko. Your magic is excellent, but I wonder if mine still works. Only one way to find out. Orko, look out! The most excellent suggestion, little one. <laughs> well, well, it looks like I do still have the touch. A pity that miserable witch Evil Lynn isn't here so I could deal with her as well. You know, that's not a bad idea. <laughs> This is Carthos. Carthos? I thought I turned him into a sand slug. That's exactly why I called. <laughs> Skeletor, I would like to propose a deal. You give me evil in, and I will give you four. I repeat, four of your enemies in trade. Skeletor, you're not going to listen to him, are you? <laughs> of course not, my dear. How could I trade my trusted right hand of evil? For them! Then what would you say if I threw in He-Man as well? At Snake Mountain, we don't listen to fools! Great evil Lin, we may be able to turn this to our advantage. When you've got He-Man, we'll talk! <laughs> we shall talk indeed, Skeletor. <laughs> I know these ones are protected by He-Man. If they're in danger, he will come immediately. My magic will overcome He-Man's strength, and then Evil Lin will be mine. What are we doing out here? It must have been Kathos's magic. Well, then use yours and, and, and get us back to dry land. Ocean, ocean, change your motion to see no more. Back to shore. Sorry, guys. I guess Kathos's magic is just too strong. Don't worry, I'll swim and get help. Adam, it's too far. Well, I think I've gone far enough. Tila won't suspect. <laughs> Still no sign of He-Man. Maybe a giant wave will speed him up. Still no sign of help. In that case, maybe we should just wave goodbye. Cringer, that's not funny, and that wave is no joke. 
Oh, who's laughing? I, I can't even swim. Oh, no, a tidal wave. There's no time to lose. By the power of Grayskull. It's gonna be a bumpy ride. Hey, Nick! Yeah, yeah, you're yeah. here! Is Adam all right? He's just fine. Now get ready. He man. For the thrill of your lives. He man. <laughs> I knew it. He man will soon be in my grasp. Sure is, old cat. Whew. Kathos, I don't know what you're up to, but you better cut it out or I'll turn you back into a sand slug. Admirable courage, little one. <laughs> but I don't think you'll have the chance. And now, for my prize catch. What's happening? I'm... Oh, getting weak. And I am about to get my revenge <laughs> on Evil Lynn. I knew you were too strong for my freeze magic, but this helmet will keep you weak as a baby <laughs> until Skeletor arrives. Where's well, Skeletor? <laughs> I have He-Man, and you know my price. I will give him to you in exchange for Evil Lynn. Quiet, you fool! Before I turn you back into the slug, you are! Forgive Evil Lynn. Bad manners, Kathos. You have done well. We'll be there to make the exchange. What are you talking about? Calm down, Evil Lynn. We must play along with his little game if we are to get He-Man. Ah, of course. You're right. As always. But Skeletor, what is this? It's all part of the game, Evil Lynn. All part of the game. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> Excellent. And so, it is time to summon my own floating palace for its latest guest. Our palace lies again. The master must be returning. Approaches. Skeletor, this is carrying things too far. I'm sorry, Evil Lynn, but capturing He-Man is more important than the personal comfort of those who serve me. You... you're selling me out to the slug? Flattery will get you nowhere, my dear. <laughs> now, come along. <laughs> Thank you for everything, Skeletor. And I do mean everything. Either in. We're enemies, but we're also each other's only hope. Use your magic to free me and my friends, and I promise I'll rescue you from Kathos. <laughs> nice try, He-Man. But from now on, you're mine. He-Man's right. He may be my enemy, but at least he will keep his word. Nice work, Evil Lynn. It's great to be back in action. Yeah, because now I can run and hide. Kathos, wait! You've got to help me with He-Man! Sorry, Skeletor, but he's your problem now. So take him with my compliments. Don't worry, Evil Lim. I'll be back. He-Man, look out! <laughs> you won't escape me now! Hey, you two 
I've got a present for you. <laughs> oh, no, you don't. Hey, what's going on? I'm too weak to move this boulder. <laughs> uh, okay, you little magician. Now you're really going to get it. Uh... All right, Tila. Go for it. Sure thing, He-Man. Now hit it. Tila, what'd you learn that? It's just a little something I picked up in warrior training school. Wow, it looks like He-Man's picking up a big something as well. Skeletor, your Rotan got stuck in the sand, so I'm giving it back to you. <laughs> Cringer, where have you been? I thought I don't mean get in the way. It is over, isn't it? No, we still have to rescue Evil Lynn. What? I gave her my word. You're right. Kavos probably dreamed of a horrible revenge for getting turned into a giant slug. But how are we, I mean, uh, I mean how are you gonna get up to that floating palace? Well, there's always a portable sky sled or two stored in the attack track. With the extra altitude this cliff gives us, we should be able to make it. But even Battle Cat couldn't fly a sky sled. You, you, you can't expect me to go. How come? Fly as a cinch. It was easy for you to say. You're right, Fringer. We'll meet you back at the palace. The one on the ground, that is. <laughs> That's a relief. Well, g good l luck, everyone. Thanks, old pal. We're gonna need it. If you try to rescue Evelyn, <laughs> you will be a sorry man. A very sorry man. Floating palace. We're almost there, <clears throat> and that's as close as you're going to get. I never thought I'd be saying this, but I hope He Man proves you wrong. Once he frees me, Kathos! <laughs> I hate to disappoint you, Evil Lynn, but He Man's rescue mission has just been cancelled. Due to stormy weather. Hey! Where did this come from? It's not like any normal storm I've ever seen. Yikes! My floating powers just shorted out! Orko! Phew! Very Stila. Uh, I think I spoke too soon. He-Man! Help! Grab hold, guys. Again. That thunderstorm was a doozy. <laughs> Why, thank you, Orko. And if you like my storm, you'll love my palace. <laughs> <laughs> we should have known it wasn't going to get any easier. I think I like the storm better. <laughs> Things are looking up to me. Let's go. But there's nowhere to go to. Then we'll just have to make a way. Oh boy, we're safe. But where are we gonna find Evil Lynn? <laughs> I'm afraid you won't. I've waited too long for my revenge to let you spoil it now. <laughs> Taylor, you and Orko look for Evil Lynn while I keep Kathos busy. You'll have to catch me first. That is, unless I catch you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Dila, look. Evil Lynn. 
again. Well, it's about time. Get me out of here. Hey, what, what, what's going on? Well, so much for surprise. Get them. <laughs> okay, Man, magic powers. Do, do, do your stuff. He said powers, not flowers. Who cares as long as it worked? Exactly. And if this force field didn't block my own magic, I'd have gotten rid of the fools. Now, if you don't mind, the key's over there. Do you really think we should? Evil Lynn kept her part of the bargain by freeing He-Man. Guess now we've got to keep ours. All right, but I wish He-Man were here. You disappoint me, He-Man. <laughs> you were so easy to stop. And after I've heard so much about your great strength, I could say the same about your wisdom, Kathos. A great wizard, but you aren't smart enough to realize that revenge is a game that no one wins. <laughs> You're wrong, He-Man. My revenge over Evil Lynn is going to be a complete triumph. But come, join me. Maybe you can change my mind. Hey! <laughs> oh, dear. I really must have that floor fixed. Uh-oh. I think I know where I'm going. But I wish I were wrong! There, Evil Man. The force screen is deactivated. Now, He-Man's promise has been kept, and if I were you, I'd leave this floating palace at once. Never! Kathos wanted his revenge. Now I want mine! <laughs> when I'm done with him, Kathos will wish she were a sand slug again! You two have served your purpose. Out of my way! Doesn't look like this gate's gonna hold much longer. But with a little luck, it won't have to. Whew. I'm glad that's over. Now to find Evil Lynn. Take that, you miserable worm! And that! No, uh, Evil Lynn! Stop! Stop! And I think I found her. Stop! I'm just getting warmed up! Just remember, you did turn me into a sand slug. I had good reason to want revenge. And you kept me cooped up in a cage, like somebody's pet flugel mouse. So now it's my turn. He man, we freed Evil Lynn, just like you said. But she doesn't seem very grateful. Grateful? Ha ha ha! You may have saved Kathos, but you won't save the floating palace. Oh no, she's heading for the control room of the palace. Now Kathos' floating palace will be totally out of control. Ah! Who knows? Maybe revenge isn't such a great idea after all. She did it. Uh, he meant she did it. Evilian actually wrecked the control system of my palace. We are doomed. I'll tell you what, Kathos. I'll save your palace if you swear off evil. Forget about revenge. Forever. Forever, I promise. It's a deal. You'd better hurry, or it's going to be too late. Quick, what have you done with our sky sleds? Come, come, I'll take you to them. Good luck. yourselves, everyone! He did it! He saved my palace! Well, of course he did! We're talking about my buddy, He-Man! The controls of my palace have been repaired, and I must thank you for saving it, and me, He-Man. You'll thank me best by keeping a promise to use your magic for good instead of evil. And forget about revenge. No need to worry, He-Man. I've learned my lesson. Revenge is something only a fool could waste time on. I am through with it. Now that makes good sense. What's more, I've thought of a wonderful way to use my magic for good. Really? What is it? Oh, no, not again. Oops. <laughs> Sorry, Oko. That's not what I had in mind. 
Now that's more like it. From now on, I'm going to fly over all Eternia. And any time a farmer needs rain for his crops, Kathos Instant Weather Service <laughs> will be there. Well, the next time Arco needs watering, we'll be sure to let you know. <laughs> <laughs> Today we learn there's no such thing as getting even. Even if someone does something to you and you get back at him. And he gets back at you. And you get back at him. And he gets back at you. And you get back at him again. And he. So you see, it never stops. No one is really getting even at all. The best thing to do is talk it over and start fresh. Now, you were going to say something? See you next time.